Welcome back. This is one of our two minute tips and tricks and it builds on the previous tips and tricks around focus peaking. So in this video we're going to look at some of the sub settings within focus peaking and in particular the sensitivity setting. After the last video on focus peaking, I got some comments that whilst focus peaking is quite a simple piece of functionality in the camera, there was interest in understanding exactly what the sensitivity controls did. And therefore, in this tips and trick, we're going to look at the sensitivity setting and what low standard and high sensitivity means in reality. So let's take a look at the settings. You'll remember to get to focus peaking, we have to go into the custom setting menu and come down to D10. Once we're in there, you'll see there's three settings for the peaking level, low, standard or high. We'll start off with high sensitivity. And here we have a very simple lens calibration uh, chart. And we're gonna be focusing on the point in the center. And what I want you to do is look at where the focus peaking lies either side of that. And what you can see is on the high setting, the red focus peaking can be clearly seen to the large one, both in front and behind the focus point on the far left. If we now go to the opposite end of the spectrum and we go to low sensitivity, what you can see is the focus peaking clearly shows up on a much narrower band and only touches the ones either side of the zero at a much smaller graduation. Hopefully showing you the two extremes of the sensitivity settings has given you an idea of what the sensitivity settings actually does and therefore we won't show you the standard one to keep this video quite brief. While we're thinking about um, when we could use different settings, we'll scroll through the different colors of the focus peaking just to give you an idea of what they look like. So when should we use the different settings? Well, from my experience, it comes down to personal preference. It comes down to how well you can see the focus peaking. What's the context um, of the image you are shooting, the scene you're shooting? Does it have well-defined contrasting edges? Or is it perhaps a softer image? What these settings do is give you the ability to tailor the focus peaking functionality to a way that works for you. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, hit subscribe, hit the notification bell. Let us know in the comments below how you've set your camera up for focus peaking and what scenarios you use it in.